Hey everyone, hope you are all doing great. In this video, I want to show you how you can send data from a form to another form. So basically, let's say your audience is filling a form, filling in their first name, email, phone number, and uh, you want to send data when, when this form is submitted, you want to send its data to another form so that customer or the audience doesn't have to fill in it again, for example, not um, fill in the uh, full name and the email address. So let's get started. I have created a first form here. So here I want to send data from this form to another form. So I'll create a new um, form here. Let's say a single step, doesn't matter if it's single or multi-step. I'll name it uh, my second form. So um, to capture data from this form, from the first form in the second form, I will create a hidden field. Um, uh, the title of the field doesn't matter. You can title it as you wish. Uh, it's customer's name, for example, but the idea is important. I'll uh, add the idea of the name. You can edit anything, uh, but you should use numbers, letters, and underscore. You cannot add space in your ID. So I'll save my second form, but uh, one step that I should do here is go to my first form, edit it, and add the same IDs as I just did here for these hidden fields to my first form. So uh, for my full name, which is here, I had the idea of name. So I'll move my face to the right. So you can see uh, here is the ID field. I added name. Uh, for the email, I had uh, added ID of email. So I'll do the same here. It was phone here, and this was option. As you can see here, it's phone, and this one is option. So I save my form here. One more step that should be done is go to settings and uh, say uh, send form data to redirect URL. And I must add a redirect URL right here which is my first uh, my second form this is uh, my first form as you see here and um when i save my second form or also i have a uh, i here which is my form and copy its link and in my first form i want my first form to be redirected to the second form and this is the second form so uh, and i want the data to be redirected to be sent to the redirect url which is this one and when you save it let's test how it works i add um my name my email i added two dots here and um, I want to add phone number and I'll have an option here and submit. So it gets redirected to my second form here. And when I submit it and get to the dashboard, let's see what happened in my forms. So here uh, on my first form, when I get to the responses, You'll see that I have my uh, full info news uh, in my email and the option I selected. And let's get back to my second form. Click on it and get to responses tab. And here I have saved my full data, my name, uh, my email, and also the option I selected in the first form. And you can also click on this I button and see the full info. So this is basically um, the perfect solution for you if you want to send data from one form to another without prompting the user to fill in data uh, multiple times. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you had any questions, just comment down below or ask us uh, using email or um, via social media and uh, get in touch with us. I hope you enjoyed it and bye for now.